How would you like to decrease the amount you suffer? The beauty of living the awakened way is that you become much more awake to the fact that you're part of one big web and you live with much greater awareness. Awareness starts with listening to your thoughts and being aware of how they affect your peace. But not only your thoughts, how about the words you use? I've recently become aware of a very simple change that we can make in how we react to situations that again can greatly decrease your suffering. And it's as simple as noticing how the normal human reaction to some kind of drama is to immediately say, oh no, I experienced this just recently when somebody rear-ended me in my new sports car. My immediate response was to pound on the roof of the car and say, no, no, no. You know what we're doing when we do that? We're denying reality. The guy rear-ended me. That's a fact. Now, how am I going to deal with that? But in saying no, we are shutting out what's really happening to us now. We're in effect in our thoughts saying, this shouldn't be happening to me, but it happened. Arguing with reality causes suffering. So what if instead of saying, oh no, we react by saying, oh my. Now, I'm the first to tell you that that was a very automatic response to say, no, no, no. But because I've trained myself to be aware of my thoughts, I immediately caught myself and said, wait a minute, how would the soul react to this accident? I took a deep breath and I realized the person who hit me could have just as easily have been me hitting the car in front of me. So I decided to greet that person with an open heart. It totally dissolved any angst between us. We both left there in a peaceful state, even though it could have turned into a real fighting match, right? So when you hear news from somebody that's upsetting, what's the first thing we say? Oh no. What if you said, oh my, I'd like you to feel the difference inside yourself. Join me in imagining a scenario where somebody you love texts you to tell you that they're not feeling well or they had to cancel some plans. The automatic human response is to type back, oh no, feel that right now. Even say it aloud, oh no. Can you feel the contraction right here in the heart? Can you feel your whole body just pull inward? Now imagine you get that same text, sorry I can't make it, or I'm not well. And now respond with, oh my. Can you feel how even keeled that is? Notice how there's no constriction. What you've just done is shift from an automatic human response to a much more neutral response, where now in this pause, you can take a deep breath and respond from the heart and be much more helpful to that other person than if you buy into the drama. I could go on and on with examples of how helpful this can be, but I'd love if after this video is over, you stop and set the intention to at least try shifting from, oh no, to, oh my, and then follow it with this phrase given to me from the spirit world that will neutralize any situation in a moment. Isn't that interesting? Again, neutrality is much more aligned with you as a soul than buying into all the drama. That doesn't help anything. To live the awakened way is to live with awareness and open heart and respond from the soul.